All right, my little kryptonauts. I have a uh, GTX 1660 Ti mining two miners by itself right now. This is a GPU that is in a Lenovo laptop. So what does it make a day mining two miners, mining Ethereum on two miners, and I'm getting about 27, 28 mega hash. The efficiency is off the scale, looking damn good on the efficiency if you look at that 558 uh, hash per watts. That's one of the best things, best efficiency I ever had. Here is the uh, hardware info or GPU-Z on that card. It is a, uh, like you said, a GE Force NVIDIA 1660 Ti. I am telling you, laptop cards are the best. Laptop mining to me for the GPUs and CPUs has been the easiest, low maintenance thing. I just turn those things on. I put them in a TP to make them air out, uh, dissipate the heat, and they just run. No maintenance, just go. I occasionally clean off the intake fans with a vacuum, but it's back and running. Uh, yeah, I love laptop mining. I wish I would have known about it when laptops were a lot cheaper. I would just bought a bunch of them. But uh, yeah, I got two running. And look at this puppy. So he is making about 79 cents a day mining two miners, mining Ethereum. So not bad. I mean, it's one card, one little old 1660 Ti. That does not take into account electricity, which can destroy your profits. So you got to mine efficient. And that's why I wanted to point out that efficiency column on the uh, T-Rex miner uh, software output. And here we are on what to mine, just to double check and see what they think we should be getting. I put in 1, 16, 60 Ti, hit calculate. I didn't put in the power, I think it's defaults to 10, which is low. I think I'm about 13 or so, who knows? The government taxes you. Coming and going, the electric companies. So here we are, uh, looks like the top three coins all mine about the same on this card, mining Ethereum, uh, ETHash right there. I mean, number three, it's yeah, it's, it's sort of accurate to what two miners are reporting. So, you know, it gives you a warm fuzzy, which is nice to know that these uh, service websites give you a nice conservative rough estimate, I guess, on what you could get with these cards. So, look, they're all about getting the same. So I'm just going to keep mining Ethereum on that card. I just ran it by itself just, just out of curiosity to see what an older 1660 Ti in a laptop could get. So there you go, 70 cents, not counting electricity. I'm out. Thanks.